Hey everyone, I'm back in the kitchen today. I'm going to be making some blueberry muffins for snacks for the week. I got some bananas on sale at the grocery store prior to the new year. So we're going to finish using up those. Blueberry banana um, muffins are Chris's favorite. Anything blueberry in this house is very popular. So I will link the recipe down below. Let's get started. So this recipe calls for one third of a cup of melted butter. So we'll get our butter going here in the pot. So our first ingredient is three large ripe bananas. Three quarters cup of sugar. We're gonna mix that so that the bananas can be mashed. One egg. And we're going to get our dry ingredients ready. One teaspoon each of baking powder and baking soda. And half a teaspoon of salt. All right, at this point we're just waiting for the butter and we'll get some blueberries out of the freezer. Okay, butter is melted. Yes, I did this on the stove. No, we do not own a microwave. No, we do not plan to own a microwave. This took the longest out of the recipe, but that's okay.
So the batter has just come together with muffins. You don't want to over mix it. So I'm just going to add the blueberries, just combine them, and then start getting these in the muffin pans. This recipe calls for a cup of blueberries, but that's not enough for us. So we'll add a cup and a half and that's just fine. So again, just until it's mixed. Alright, cookie scoop again, I believe this one is one inch, and a heaping scoop will fill each muffin cup. Well filled muffin cups. And we'll get this in our preheated oven. Should take about 20 to 25 minutes for baking. Okay, muffins look done, so we're gonna grab those out of the oven. They smell amazing. So we did invest in some new muffin tins. Chris got me some Le Creuset muffin tins for my birthday. They're a bit more expensive than the ones you can get at like Canadian Tire or something, but I'm not buying muffin liners anymore. Bonus points is you get a crispy bottom on your muffin.